Assalamu alaikum. Say. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Give. For his wailing, yeah. Shay Effendi was ridiculed and obst obstructed in doing his work. How did we respond to this? Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Like a sultan, like a saint. Hmm. Dogs may bark, but the caravan continues. He never stopped to bark back. He's ridiculed, he's uh, obstructed, he's criticized, he's slandered, uh, he's even been called uh, kafir. Not by common people, by certain high level people. He just sits and he smiles. And he continues his work. And Alhamdulillah, his work is continuing. And his work is getting stronger and it's getting bigger. It's showing the power of that share that he doesn't have to be here physically for his work to continue. So many you see share coming, thousands come, coming out from the woodwork, eh? like bugs, like scorpions, coming out. The share leaves everyone going back to their own selfish lifestyle. Nothing is achieved. Share comes, whoop, another one coming and going. No. But nothing is done. Nothing, there's no community being built. There's no real work. There is no washing up. There's no knocking wall to wall. Because it's impossible now to attract thousands of people even knocking them wall to wall because people are not stupid. <laughs> They're going to say, why I'm going to go to that Shaykh? Every time I'm going to go to him and he's going to knock me wall to wall. I'm not going to go. I'm going to go to another Shaykh that smiles at me and say what a saint I am. High level person. And that to just sit with him, I'm going to achieve fana. I'm going to go to that Shaykh. People are not stupid, right? <laughs> so, yeah. now, they're continuing with us, of course. But are we responding? No, we don't respond. Bizwal Smanlu is pig shyness. We are Ottomans and we have honor. And we don't bark back to those dogs. Uh, we will see what is ahead when the dust settles. Whether it's a horse or it's a donkey. We are not concerned if people approve us or people disapprove us. We are very concerned every day to live for the sake of Allah, not to fail Him and to continue our Shaykh's work. That's what we are busy with. We're not busy with photo opportunities. We're not busy with this dunya. We're busy with this work. Very humble work we're doing. And because of that, so many people are finding us a threat. They found Sheriff Andy a threat, although he only had a few cripples around him. And now that he passed, they're so happy. They think that the threat has passed. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait till you see what's going to happen. Because the sword is unsheathed, it's opened. Now it's still not showing too much, but it's going to. That time is going to what? It's going to cut. It's going to separate. The furkan. You understand? The sword will separate. Sahib al Saif will start to separate. Make sure you're on the right side. Be sincere. Are we thinking we are somebody? No. <laughs> Believe us, we spend enough time with our share to even have that thought crossed in our hearts to think that we are somebody, that we're achieving somewhere, is um, unusual for us. And they ex remind us every time. So, this is how he handled it. It's not like other ones getting on social media, barking back, bark, 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 bark. Then this one, bark, 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 back at that one. That one, bark, 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 back at this one. 
they some bark back at that one, and then later to say, when there are so many thousands caught in the crosshairs, later say, oh, it's just a test. We are barking, but we're really nice to each other. It's just a test. Those who are, you are fail. <laughs> they don't do that. Saints don't entrap you like that. We want to believe it too. Maybe they are, it's just a test. They're not really barking at each other. But we see, oh, subhanAllah, they continue to bark and now they're biting. So it used to be when lions, they fight, the street dogs don't interfere, right? Now because it's Ahir Zaman, <laughs> when the street dogs, they fight, the lions, they don't interfere. So we don't interfere. We are very simple, humble people. <laughs> There's a couple of people around, crooked, one day up, one day down, doing things. But we have our firm handhold. We have the Urwati Butqa. Firm handhold, our Shah, that is holding us always with a tight leash. Inshallah, we will never deviate. Definitely, when he comes back, first thing I'm going to say to him is, Sheikh, I failed you. But if we have that, it will keep us in check, inshallah. We must try. We must try harder. We must look to see where. It's not rhetoric. I'm not saying it just for fun. I'm saying I can have proof for that. I'm concentrating on that. I'm not concentrating on the success or the work that we have done. I cannot take credit for anything anyway. Sheikh Effendi is doing it. Whatever that we must take credit for is to take credit for the wrong things that we have done. And that is ayat. So if you, are, if you want to be with us on that boat of Nuh salam, welcome to you. If not, Welcome to you too. Welcome to those who come. Farewell to those who leave.